So we have another custom room which is kind of stock and quite minimal but it's having some very useful things especially in the terms of performance. One of the best custom room in the terms of performance and doesn't matter which device you're using for most of the devices this should be one of the best custom rooms in the performance if you are talking about. It's based on Android 14 and we are talking about AOSPA or you can say paranoid android it's also updated to the latest android version it's already updated to the latest security update and having all the latest features already this does not it gives you a pixel launcher pre-installed if you move on to the launcher uh, if you consider it like other ones which is having launcher three base launcher it's kind of similar but it's different here it's not having the same kind of customizations same amount of customizations Although some very useful things like add a glance widget which you can hide or unhide and also you have the option for some options in the recent panel customizations overall a very useful thing if you're looking forward to quick settings panel as expectedly in dark mode and why I am sharing this with you because it's not a customization focused custom room it's not a feature packed custom room it's just kind of stock UI minimal UI but having very very interesting things one feature which is actually missing from here what i was actually looking forward to is the app cloning unfortunately that's not present here but in case you want to install the app cloning feature in this custom room what you need to do is simply root your device install pixel expert magisk module you will be able to enable the app cloning feature and that should work fine in most of the devices most of the custom rooms i'm talking about the latest android 14 based custom rooms moving on to the gestures options if you move on to the navigation options, you will not find the hide IME space option, but the option to hide the gesture bar is present here. It already has some interesting screenshot options, or I mean to say some gestures like swipe to screenshot, which was kind of expected because this feature was not present in Lineage OS, and that's good that at least it's present in Paranoid Android. But it also brings you some screen of gestures which are working fine. In most of the custom rooms, what you have, you have double tap to wake. But in this case, you have some options to customize the double tap action. So for example, if I choose double tap to wake, let me show you how this will work. If you double tap your device uh, on the lock screen, you will see it will simply wake up. But you have the option to toggle the flashlight in case you want to, for example, like this one, as you can see, it's just working perfectly fine. This is how these things work. But including these double tap to double tap gestures, we already have some other options too. Wallpapers and style also have the custom lock screen clocks, the latest Android 14 clocks available. And of course, this is also one of the advantages over Lineage OS. So if you are a fan of Lineage OS stability or the performance, etc., then we have a great competitor. We have Paranoid Android. The launcher, because it's not Pixel Launcher, so we have extra grid options present in case you want to customize the rows and columns layout, etc. And having all the options related to fonts and etc. Fonts are quite good, like Google Sans, of, of course, one of my favorite fonts are present here. Some system icon packs and icon shapes, but everything else is just kind of similar. So who, who can install this build on their devices? So for example, if you are a user who love to use minimal custom rooms without having major customization, without looking forward to the customizations of features then this could be a great choice for you in the terms of performance that's one of the best so don't miss it out link is already available in the description so make sure to check it out thanks for watching we'll see you in the next one